Well, good morning. It's day five. I think we may end up just hanging around here at Port Augusta today. We're out here this morning at the Matthew Flinders Ranges Walk and Red Cliffs. We just wanted to come and check this out for the morning and see what it looks like. I did look on the weather this morning for the Flinders Ranges and it said it's going to be extremely overcast if not raining out there. So I really don't want to drive two hours out there and not be able to shoot anything. So I think we're just going to just hang out around here for the day because there's plenty to see around here anyway. And uh, I've st still got plenty of work to do which I haven't caught up with yet either. So I think we might just do that today and just uh, hang out around the area here. Beautiful little area, love this place. Imagine the cliffs could look really good in the afternoon in the summertime, but I'm not sure we'll get the right light today. We might come back later on and see if we can get some good light, see how we go. Port Augusta is actually a pretty cool place. I don't mind it. It's almost like a little seaside town really. You got lots of access to the water, to the ocean, lots of jetties to cruise along. It's a nice little place. All right, well that's gonna wrap things up for us here at Red Cliffs. We're just gonna head into town now and check out the area there and uh, see what else is on offer in Port Augusta. So we're just here now at the old water tower lookout in Port Augusta. It's pretty cool that you can come up this set of stairs here and get a look out. You've got a 360 degree view. You wouldn't want to be scared of heights though because uh, the stairs down the bottom here are see-through. <laughs> They're just steel stairs and you can see right through to the bottom. Even on this level you've got a pretty good view around the place. It is caged off up the top, obviously for safety reasons. So you've got a nice view up there, out to the port and to the Gulf. It's pretty cool. Great that small towns have places like this where you can do this sort of thing. You know, makes life a little bit more interesting. You wouldn't get this kind of thing in the city at all. Too many safety regulations. Well, it was definitely cool to come and check this out. It's directly across the road from the Rotary Park. Doesn't look all that high, but you get, really do get a really nice view of uh, Port Augusta and of the Gulf and the surrounding area, which is quite cool. All right, let's get back on the road and check a bit more of the place out. All right, we're just at another stop here in Port Augusta. We've just come down to the jetty here just to uh, hang out by the water for a little while today and just enjoy the view. It's an interesting little place. I, I dig Port Augusta. It's 
got that sort of sleepy seaside town kind of feel to it. So uh, I haven't minded staying here for the day. There's been plenty of little things to kind of pop in and have a look at. You've got the Matthew Flinders Walk that we uh, just went and checked out before. I'm actually going to be staying at a van park that's right near the bottom of Red Cliffs. All right, well, we're going to uh, cruise in and do a little bit of boring stuff now, go to the shops, get a bit of get a couple of supplies and uh, then get settled in for the day and get a bit of work done and uh, get ready for the big stint. Over the next few days we've got Cooper Pitti all the way up to Uluru over the next few days so we've got a big few days coming up. So I think we're just going to have a bit of a cruise around uh, the rest of town for the day now and uh, just see what else is on offer around here. Alright, well that's going to wrap things up for us today here in Port Augusta. It's been a nice relaxing day. I've really enjoyed just kind of chilling out and cruising around to uh, check out the local attractions. Port Augusta is a place I really didn't hear a lot great about and I was actually really quite pleasantly surprised by how cool it's actually been. So um, definitely a place I'd recommend coming through and checking out yourself. All right, well, we've got a really huge day tomorrow, Cooper Pedy, and there's lots to do in Cooper Pedy. So uh, we're gonna have a nice early night tonight. We've got a lot of work done today, which is great. And uh, we'll see you in the morning.